Can you tell me your name? My name is Hanukkah. And where are you from? Parker, Arizona. What did Jesus do to, for you today at Dr. Maria Karnak's healing meeting? <sighs> He's done a lot. Um, I've been dealing with pain. I've been, I had a surgery in 2021, height of COVID, and my appendix was taken out. And the doctor performed the surgery and she cut one of my intestines and didn't even check it. And I was fighting for my life. It was a long road in the hospital from December, the beginning of December until the middle of January, being stuck in a room crying. Lord, help me. Lord, heal me. It's hard. It's hard. I understand that it's hard. You know, and I'm a believer in Christ. And it was Him who kept me the entire time. It was Him. The doctors didn't know if I was going to live or die. After about an hour of staying there, you know, one of the doctors said, I didn't know. I didn't know what was going to happen. But you know, Jesus knew. Jesus knew. And I praise God, you know, I'm, I've always wanted to go to one of these meetings. And, you know, and tonight, I just, I was in pain. So much pain. And my legs hurt, my back hurt, my stomach hurt, you know. So you were in constant pain I all was, the time. All the time, you know. And some days it would take a lot out of me and I couldn't do anything that day, you know, sitting there just, you know, struggling with the pain. And now, after coming, praise God, I'm healed. You know, I felt the power of God touch my body and no more, no more pain. The healing came. Jesus touched me and it is real. All I knew is tonight I needed my miracle. And nothing was going to stop me from getting it. It almost did, but it didn't. That's when you know you need it the most. Yes. When things get in the way of going, when things get in the way, your children, you know, outside activities, that's when you know you should go. You should come to one of these meetings and be healed. Because he still hears you. He still loves you. And he hasn't forgotten about the people. No, he, he hasn't. hasn't. So I just praise him and I thank him for everything that he's done in my life and everything that he's going to do in your guys' life. Amen. And, and one more time, who healed you again tonight? Jesus. Praise the Lord. Thank Jesus. you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> thank you, Lord.